क्लास टेंथ इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम पेयर ऑफ लीनियर इक्वेशन फादर्स एज इज थ्री टाइम्स द सम ऑफ एजेस ऑफ इज टू चिल्ड्रेन सो सम ऑफ द एजेस ऑफ इज टू चिल्ड्रेन आफ्टर फाइव ईयर्स हिज एज विल बी ट्वाइज द सम ऑफ द एजेस ऑफ इज टू चिल्ड्रेन नो हियर लेट सी हियर लेट द फादर्स एज बी लेट द फादर्स एज बी एक्स ईयर्स and i'll consider sum of the ages sum of ages of his two children see most important here sum of ages of his two children i'll consider it as y consider sum of ages of his two children b y years so in y here we have two children okay now so the condition is first condition given conditions first one is the told father's age is three three times the sum of the ages of his two children so according to this question father's age is x is three times the sum of the ages of his two children that is 3y because in y already i consider two children so here father's age is three times the sum of the ages of his two children this is one equation if you want you can write in standard form x minus 3y Equals zero. This is equation one. Next, second equation. After five years, his age will be twice the sum of the ages of his two children. So here, five years later, five years later, father's age will be. Father's age will become like x plus five. And here. Sum of the ages of two children will be sum of the ages of two children. Sum of the ages of two children. It will become say y five years later. This I am writing for five years later. So y plus five plus five. Y two times five I wrote because five years later. Because in this y we have two children. so for both the persons the age will increase by 5 so this is for the first ch child this is for the second child so y plus 5 plus 5 so this will become total age will be sum of the ages will be y plus 10 years now according to the question after 5 years his age will be twice so father's age will be twice the age of sum of the ages of his two children so y plus 10 so most of the children they'll get confused y plus 10 because it is very clear in y there are like two children so for one child it is 5 and the for the other one it is plus 5 so now if we simplify x plus 5 equals 2y 2 times 10 20 so x plus 5 minus 2y minus 20 equals 0 if we we'll simplify further now see x minus 2y 5 minus 15 is 5 minus 20 is minus 15 Equals zero. This is equation two. Now, both the equations solving one and two. Solving one and two. See, I'll go for substitution because it's easy here. Because directly we have the value of x. X equals three y. This value I'll substitute in the second equation. X minus two y minus fifteen equals zero. So in place of x, I'll substitute three y. So I'm substituting 3y in place of x. 3y minus 2y minus 15 equals zero. So here now, 3y minus 2y is y. 1y minus 15 equals zero. So y equals 15. So sum of the ages of two children is 15. Now we need to find actually find the age of father. So father is x. So if we we'll substitute this value here, x equals three times. 15 because x equals 3 y so x equals 45 so father's age is 45 years he is 45 years old in this way we need to solve the only tough part in this is in y we are considering it as two children so after 5 years if they will tell we need to add 2 times 5 because there are two persons in this one. 